All right, guys, today we're going to put together a gazebo. As you can see, it's a Berkley & Jensen 12x10 hardtop gazebo. It's got a book of instructions and screws, and right here, as you can see, came in two boxes. It's about 500 pounds worth of stuff, all steel, lots of screws and pieces, and there's a book. Here's all the pieces. And my plan is to put together what I can inside the garage, because right now it's raining, and... So far, I added some bottoms to these poles and the top pieces, some brackets. So whatever I can do in this instruction manual, I will do. It's even got some netting came with it. It doesn't look too, too bad. So we'll see. But the plan is to get that up and onto my deck out there. I'm going to just screw it right down to that deck. Okay. We'll see how long it takes. So far, I put together the four side braces, which is uh, two of them are 10 foot and two are 12 foot. They're basically two pieces with um, a beam that goes in between them to hold them together. Pretty simple. So you do all of this stuff off to the side, and then you take the four main legs, which are right here. I already put the ends on them. And you lay it down and put those together and you make your uh, rectangular gazebo. So we'll do that next. Alright guys, now I'm going to put the uh, center roof together. There's four of these. And four um, small brackets there. Looks like maybe three feet one way or two feet. And four feet the other way. It's that center of the roof that's a little bit raised. And it's pretty simple. They just slide in just like that. And you put two screws on each side. So I'm going to put that all together and show you what that looks like. All right, I screwed the roof panel together. And as you can see, I'm leaving the plastic just to reduce scratches on it. You can always just peel it right off when after I'm uh, assembling the whole thing. But for now, I'm going to leave it on there. And actually, it looks like it's probably about maybe five and a half feet I think you're well I'm shrinking <laughs> by maybe three feet the top of the panel so that's all together and we'll put this to the side and I'll have it ready to a lot of prep work and I'll see what else I can prep in advance Okay, next I'm going to put together the top of the center roof right here, this piece. You can see AA and four ABs and uh, the H1 screws again. And I'll put that together, which is all right here. Here's the piece. Well, the actually attached one little leg so far, or one roof piece. That's the top of the roof. Again, I'm leaving the plastic on it just to reduce scratching. All right, that's it for today. I gotta get some help to um, put together the main base. It's kind of hard to do one person, so I'll get a friend over here and I'll get that going tomorrow. All right, guys, next I'm going to put the uh, poles outside, the big brackets that I put together, the cross beams that are 12 foot two of them and two 10 foot i'm gonna lay everything out and then start putting together Okay, that's one side. 
All right, I'm going to take some measurements and center it on the deck. Put a couple of screws in the uh, poles to hold it in place so I can put the cross brackets. Hopefully, I'll get some help here before uh, I get to that. All right, I got the sides up, and now I got to put these corner brackets with these little brackets on each corner. That's next. Okay, corner brackets are on. Little roof brackets. Started taking this stuff off now since it's not going to scratch on the ground anymore. And now I'll start working on the roof. Okay, some of the crossbars for the roof are now done. And we're going to put the small roof in the middle on next. There's the curtain rods, I guess you'll call them. Right there. All right, guys, it got late. It's a little dark out, but we did finish it. Uh, I know the camera turned off and we got crazy into it, so I didn't record a lot of it, but you can see the ceiling. It's dark out, but you can see, and I'll take some pictures of it during the day. We put the curtain, uh, actually it's like a screen. You can close it in. Yeah, I'll take pictures of it during the day. I gotta put a few more screws in the roof because it got dark out. So I'm not sure if we missed anything. But we really didn't get started, I'd say, till probably about uh, 4.30 or so. So it took maybe about five hours with a little pre-prep the day before of like me putting together a few things that I think I showed you. So all in all, not bad. It's pretty strong, I like it this from the outside if you can see I'll do it in the daylight tomorrow hopefully uh, me doing it with my friend will show you that it's not that hard and a couple of hours you get it up so not not bad and it's the first one we ever did so all right thanks for watching and I'll see you guys next time don't forget to subscribe later